Maria and today I would like to introduce you to my little friend Tilly. My friend is called Tulsi in Hindi and Desi in English. Tulsi means incomparable and it is truly an incomparable herb. This plant belongs to mint family and has many herbal uses. In Ayurveda, it is used to make medicines and tonics. The leaves of this plant are used to treat fever and cold. In our country, it is considered very sacred and a household medicine. I daily give water to my plant and fertilizer when required and you will be surprised to know I do talk to my friend. Recent studies have shown that the leaves of Tulsi act as anti-stress agents promotes digestion and helps in maintaining insulin level in our body. Moreover, Tulsi is super useful for battling respiratory infections. Nowadays, Tulsi is also used for making kada to fight deadly coronavirus. Tulsi is antibacterial, antifungal, antiviral and antioxidant. No wonder, Tulsi is the elixir of life. So, I hope you enjoyed meeting my friend. Tilly. Hello friends, my name is Dr. Kumar Shiv and today I am going to tell you about my favorite plant and my favorite plant is commonly called yellow elf and it is scientifically called Denospora cardifolia. It is also known as Amrita or Rutochi Hindi and I have named this a cute little friend of mine is Gilly. It is a creeper and grows on a tree and it is mainly found in countries like India, Bangladesh, Pakistan, Nepal and Sri Lanka. And it's an Ayurvedic herb that has been used and advocated in India medicine ages. Gila is a natural immunity booster. It has amazing benefits in treating health conditions. It can be taken daily. It's almost all parts can be used to cure diseases. However, the most important part is stem and is widely available in our restaurant. Antipyretic in nature, which means it can reduce chronic fever. It also has anti-inflammatory properties. In current situation of COVID-19, it is commonly used to boost one immunity, not even immunity. It is believed to treat chronic fevers and indigestion and diabetes and so on. Hope you people will also love my cute little friend for its properties. I hope you do enjoy the video with me and with my friend Gil. And stay home, stay safe, bye bye. Hey everyone, my name is Tripla and today I will be introducing you to my little friend Ali. Commonly called Almera, this plant has been recognized for its medicinal properties since time immemorial. This non-toxic plant, also known as plant of immortality, stores water in its leaves and can even survive in low rainfall and arid regions. The aloe vera leaf looks very unique. The edges of the leaves have tiny spikes and it does not have any stem. Aloe vera is mainly cultivated for agricultural and medicinal purposes. However, it also grows successfully as a potted plant in many gardens. The aloe vera leaves secrete a clear gel which, when broken off from the rest of the plant, can heal wounds, soothe the skin and condition your hair. It has antioxidant properties, reduces wrinkles, reduces blood sugar in diabetics, prevents cavities and can also be used as a body moisturizer. The aloe vera juice can boost your immunity in coronavirus. So that's all about my little plant and I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you.
many plants. Hello friends, today I am going to tell you about my favorite plant, Graciana trapeziana, which is commonly known as a snake plant. There are around 70 species of snake plant, all native to subtropical and tropical region of Europe, Asia and Africa. They are all evergreen and can grow anywhere from 8 inches to 12 feet. Talking about the ability of this plant, it can clean air better than most other Indo plants as it has the ability to clean excessive amounts of carbon monoxide from the air. It can also clean toxins from air like benzene, ethylene and formaldehyde. Efforts to show the importance of plants. Hope you enjoyed the video and please.